Hi guys and welcome to the very first Superfund Partners e-newsletter. We're trying to do things a little bit differently this month onwards. Uh, hope you all had a really lovely Easter break. Uh, lots of chocolates and lots of hot cross buns. Uh, we certainly ate way too many here in the office. So it's March already, um, we're nearly at the end of March and for the first quarter we've been so busy trying to get basses all lodged on time, finishing up those super funds that we need to get done before the end of May lodgement deadline as well. Um, so the team has been very busy obviously getting in contact with all of you uh, and making sure everything is up to date. Uh, you'll also notice that we've probably had more face-to-face -face meetings than we ever have before which is really lovely to put your faces to the names and you probably feel the same about us too. So April is at the end of this week, um, so just around the corner. Things to watch out for for trustees now until the end of June are looking at contribution caps. So for those that are salary sacrificing, really important to make sure that you're not going to breach any of those caps by the extra contributions going in. Um, for those of you that are on pensions, crucial that we make sure that the minimum drawdowns are made before 30 June. Uh, really important uh, from a compliance standpoint and also to make sure that your super fund is staying in the 100% tax free phase if that's where you're at. Uh, the other thing is property. If you have a property and haven't had a valuation done on your property for three years, probably a really good time to start engaging with a real estate agent to get that valuation done. Uh, and also any expenses um, that you've incurred throughout the year. If you have them, um, probably start collating them and shoot them through to us because it just makes the annual accounts uh, end of year process that much easier for us if we have all the information at hand. So some light reading. Um, we've got some blogs that we're putting up uh, for this month. The first one that we're looking at is the 1st of July changes for collectibles and the accountant's exemption, so going through a few things there. Uh, property expenses again, having a look at how we treat them and what the different uh, expenses are and their tax outcomes. Uh, and also data feeds. Um, we look at what the data feeds are, what they allow us to do and what we still require from you at the end of the year. So have a read of those. Um, and as always, if you want to have a chat, please give us a call anytime or pop in for a coffee. All right, till next month. Bye.